How are we doing today? This is EMS Automotive, manufacturer of sheet metal for a lot of Chevrolets and Fords from 1935 to 1958. Today, we're going to be talking about 49 to 52 Chevrolet sheet metal. We're talking about USA meat, USA made sheet metal. We make it in our own factories. So we're going to go to, we're going to, go to the most popular parts over here, the tail pan. Tail pan is the area of the car underneath the trunk lid in front of the back bumper. This is a tail pan for your 49 to 52 Chevrolet. This is for your, happens to be for your fleet line. It has a little dip over here. Fleet line has a special shape, you know, a great fast back look. One big piece to fix it up. All that rust that comes down and along here when it gets dented up. 18 gauge steel made in the USA. Notice none of our parts are painted at black Chinese tissue paper steel. All the factory shapes and curves in there, rolls underneath like it's supposed to. That's for the fleet line. If you happen to have a regular two-door sedan coupe convertible, here's your part right here. Almost identical, but has slightly different curves and shapes just for your body style. You tell us what body style you have, we got a tail pan for you, EMS tail pan, made in the USA. This is for your 49 to 50 two-door sedans. 51, 52 would be here. We're banging the sheet metal really good. 4952 has a very unique tail light that, that curves out over here. That's a separate piece. This is your tail pan. Factory seam to factory seam. We'll make that clear. Factory seam to factory seam is what we do. Made in the USA. Great stuff. Ships out of our own distribution warehouses. Nothing is, nothing is jobbed out to some supplier. We do it. We make it. We pack it. If it gets damaged in UPS, we pay for it. So we guarantee that the product will reach your house undamaged. Behind the tail pan is the, what we call the trunk floor extension. Main trunk floor is out over here. This, this will drops down by the tail pan, and your tail pan is going to be right here. This flange, or this flange on the trunk floor extension will spot weld to this flange right here and I'll turn this part around so you can see it, so you can see it banging apart some more damage and shit we'll take care of it there's a the little flange right there and this part comes around and sits right in there like that and that's your trunk floor and your trunk floor extension we put all the grooves and bumps Get a nice little offset so you could tuck it up underneath and make, make some nice welds. 18 gauge steel, all made in the USA. Now, one of the interesting things is people ask us, okay, I got the tail pan, I've got the trunk floor extension. What about that funny piece of metal between the bumper and the body? That's called a gravel shield. EMS makes that also. This is your part right here die stamped, holes, perfectly flat where it needs to be, no wrinkles. These will rust out a little bit here, but they also get banged up. The slightest little bump on the bumper in the back of the, back in the day will get this thing wrinkled up a little bit. Kind of hard to get it straightened out. So we make it, it bolts right on the bottom. Get that out of the way, it bolts right on the bottom. There you go, just like that and then your bumper will be out over here. So that's great. And you notice, notice the body lines, all smooth and crisp, just like they're supposed to be. Throw some paint on that and you'll be cruising in no time. EMS Automotive. If you need a catalog, we have paper catalogs. With all of our parts in there, just call us at customer service, 216-541-4585. We got a website, emsautomotive.com. If you like Facebook and Instagram, we got our Facebook and Instagram addresses right there, and the camera guy is going to zoom in on it and keep his thumbs out of the camera. So, and he's laughing. Okay, that's good. All right, you can't hear that. Okay, another part while we're at it, before we jump something, the front fenders. Where the front fender from the, you got the front wheel over here where you steer with. This is your back door over here, rusts out often, 18 gauge steel, has a nice little loft set, it has your fender opening, has, this will get hemmed around onto the bracket. Oh, what about that bracket? Well, that bracket's right there. 
that goes right in there, double walled, fits right, you know, fits right up in there, and you'll hem that over, and that's your inner, that's your inner brace for that front fender. Notice it always rusted out, so that's where the rust got in there with the bolt hole, packed full of dirt. Right now we're going to be talking about the rocker panel from door post to door post, the lower front quarter where we got the fender bulge, and the lower rear quarter behind the rear wheel. Okay, that's what we're going to be talking about next. What we have right here on the table, we have the lower front quarter panel. This is the back part of your door on a two-door sedans and convertibles. Sedan delivery, we have that unique special one for them too. Notice the bulge. This thing is huge. All formed by EMS in their own factories with their own tooling in the United States. Notice, no black paint, no Chinese tissue paper metal. All USA made. Spot weld flange. All smooth, no wrinkles. Look at those cheap guys. Oh, I'm going to save money. Yeah, and you can spend three hours trying to take the wrinkles out of it. We got the door jam. We got the offset. We have over here. We roll into the fender area very nicely. So we have that if you want to put your skirts on. Okay, we have the offset up here so you can slide it under. If you like to, some guys like to butt weld them. They just cut it off, they butt weld them, use their Clecos, whatever, and they get it on there. Over here, we start up around that wheel opening. We go a couple inches into it. We have a nice offset flange over here with extra so you can do the proper adjustment. Lower front quarter panel in front of the rear tire between the door. Okay, now that this will fit all 49 to 52 Chevrolets. Two-door sedan, four-door sedan, convertibles will not fit the four-door. Sedan delivery has their own. And we do make that for them. When we go behind the rear wheel, we have the lower rear quarter panel. This happens to be the 4950 version. Notice that we got the sweep in there. It is not straight. It is has the correct contour, just like the factory made it. Around here, roll underneath locations, nice thick steel all the way around there, not cheap, not rolled. Here's your, here's your impression for the bumper opening. If you keep your bumpers, you cut that little hole out. We got the offset over here, rolls around the corner to the tail pan, the tail panel weld up over here if you, if you need it. This one, is, this one is for 49 to 50, all body styles, two-door sedan, four-door sedan, convertible, and this will fit the sedan delivery also. Okay, now we're going to the 5152. Slightly different. The big difference on the 5152, they have a little bit different tail pan. This shape is slightly different than the 4950. We got the opening already cut out for those guys on the 4952s. They go to get, it goes together like this. We have plenty of extra there so you can adjust it. It comes in there, so plenty of overlap. If you need that extra little quarter inch to get it to fit right, to get your skirts to fit right, we have it there for you. Okay, made in the USA. That's great. Um, that's on that. Now we're talking about the rocker panel. We make the rocker panel just like the factory did. From door post to door post. You know, the front door post to the factory seam, right? They had it right at the rear door post die stamped, all the correct angles, all the correct curves, 18 gauge steel, made in our tooling in our own factories here in the United States. And then behind, behind the outer rocker is the inner rocker. We stamp this too, notice we stamp in all the braces, all the correct shape. See if we can get this together for you. And It'll go together and make a box assembly for you. Okay, hey, we're back again. We're doing some interesting little parts. We just finished up with the quarter panels. This is your spare tire well. Look at how deep that is. That's nine and a half, ten inches deep. Die stamped in the United States, heavy 18 gauge steel. Fits your 49 to 54 Chevrolet. So if your spare tire well is rusted out, that'll take care, that'll take care of that. Okay, now we're going to jump we're going to jump forward a little bit to the door bottoms. EMS makes our proprietary door bottom kits, which is the in order to fix up the rusted bottom of your doors. 
Each door bottom kit from EMS includes a 20 gauge outer skin, die stamped with all the curves, sharp corners, all the radiuses, 18 gauge steel, has the flanges that you can hem over onto the inner door structure, so it sits on there just like the factory made it. The inner door structure comes in the kit. This is 18 gauge steel, just like they originally did. Notice all of the shapes, curves, beads, everything finely pressed out in our own tooling. Even, we even include the hinge pocket over here so you can put your hinges on there, drill some holes, use the stock hinges, use the hidden hinges, whatever you want, gull wings, guys do everything, we're set up for that inner door structure. All little beads, your clips, everything's here, little offset so you could tuck it up in there and weld it real nice, don't have to worry about burn through. 18 gauge steel, 20 gauge steel, fits all two door 49 to 52 Chevrolets, two-door sedan, two-door hardtop, convertible, using, using this kit here. Sedan delivery, we use it, we cut it down a little bit to make it fit the sedan delivery, no problem. Those guys really love their cars and are willing to do that. Hey, we're back. We changed the parts on the table. 49 to 52 Chevrolet, we're going to be talking about floor pans. A lot, a lot of, lot of disinformation on floor pans. That's why I made this video so you know what's going on. EMS makes their own product. All of our product is heavy, 18 gauge steel, just like they used back in 1949. None of that paper thin stuff that you can see through from China. Notice there's no black on it, so we're okay. This is the front floor pan for your 49 to 52 Chevrolet fits all your body styles two doors four doors convertible sedan deliveries 18 gauge steel notice got the ribs all the impressions the deep stampings the grooves the pads for your seat the offset so you could tuck it up underneath rolls up to touch the transmission cover okay speaking of transmission cover it's right here Okay, same thing, 18 gauge, all the shape if you need. It doesn't rust out too often. A lot of them got hacked up for four speeds and transmissions in the racing days. We got it if you need it. 18 gauge steel made in the USA. Make the floor pans left and right, stamped as they're supposed to be. Now we're going to jump to the rear floors. The rear floors, here again, heavy 18 gauge steel. Notice the very, very deep stampings that we make. We got the grooves, we got the grooves, we got the offset, we got the little steps. No, no, no expense was spared in our tooling to make it. We rise up just, we rise up to go just underneath the rear seat. So when you put your rear seat cushion on there, it'll be right here, covering up your welded seams. We make them in left and right. Notice when you put the two together, you have the drive shaft tunnel is included. In our, when, you, when you get the left and right floor pan. So if you only need one, it's going to fit in there perfectly. And notice it's up high. It's going to be easy. When you grind your welds, it's going to be easy. Notice that we have our floor pans here in a couple of pieces. People wonder why. Why can't I get it in one big piece? How are you going to get it to your house? It would have to be in a huge crate shipped to your house by truck carrier. And you know that never works easy. Mama's going to be home yelling at you that she's got to unload the truck while you're at work. All of our product ships UPS. You know how easy UPS is? They drop it off at your door, no problems. Everything we make in EMS is made to go UPS, so it goes easy. That's convenience for you. We ship it to your house, ship it to your work, ship it to your body shop. We'll ship it anywhere in the world UPS goes, and they go everywhere. So that's why, we, that's why we have the pieces. Up front, we have the tow boards. Tow boards are where you have your gas pedal, your brake, your clutch, if you had a clutch. Okay, we make these in lefts and rights. We have the offset. Die stamped with all the correct impressions. All the little, cur all the little curves. All the shapes gonna go right in. UPS, specify left or right. You know, we know rust more because that driver was always in the car, dragging his dirt and feet in there. So that's why if all you need is one piece, we just sell you one piece. You don't have to buy the whole thing. You just buy what you need, goes UPS. Very nice. 
The biggest thing is, guys ask, when we got the floor pans, there's the braces underneath the floor. And what we have for the floor braces, there's three braces along the sides. Front, rear, and center. Okay, we're gonna, get, we're gonna get them out over here and make a little bit of noise. These are our floor braces. They go underneath, they'll go underneath the floor, and they'll, they'll have a rubber pad that goes to the frame. We have the rubber pads if you need them. We have those, we don't make the rubber pads, but we have them because it's a convenience. This is made out of extra heavy 16 gauge, just like it's supposed to be, that's .065. It's very thick, very hard. We have to use our bigger presses to push all this stuff down and push it into the shape. Like I said, we got three. This is your center brace. Okay, 18 gauge, has the area. Drill the hole wherever you need it for, for your body or frame. If you're using your aftermarket frame, our Morrison frame, racing frame, roller chassis. Here on the rears, we put the holes in there for you because we were nice about it. Here again, we notched everything, 18 gauge. Now, one of the other interesting things that people forget about, and it's kind of hard to explain, is the front floor brace is there sitting on, sitting on the frame out, out here, out over here by the door post. It's right underneath. The front door post is sitting right here, okay? And on the top, that's often rusted as part of the floor pan. It's part number 213. It's the door post reinforcement. Sits on the, sits on the floor pan. Sits on the floor pan over here with the door post. This, bra this brace is is underneath is underneath it like this. Sits on top. It sits on top. You'll see it when you wire brush your dirt away. It often fills up with dirt and it's hard to see. But you, when you clean it away and you wire brush it, you'll see some remnants of this there when your floor pan's rusted out. This 213 will take care of it. Ships UPS absolutely great stuff like i said made in the usa nothing black of the cheap chinese metal all of our parts ship with our name on it our name is ems automotive you'll always see our sticker on it if it doesn't have our sticker you know it's not ours because we make the best stuff high quality precision fitting replacement parts telephone 216-541-4585 emsautomotive.com we got a website you can buy there. You can call us direct. Call us on the phone. We'll ship you the parts direct. We have a retail outlet for you. And if you need to see us on Facebook, we're on Facebook and Instagram under EMS Automotive.